Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com with 2022, a brand new release. Topps Chrome Cosmic Baseball. Six box, half case, pick your team number one. Oh, this is only a half case? Hmm. Oh, it's the random team that's the full case. I think I blocked out time for a full case break. Anyway, anyway we got a random team version on jazbeescasebreaks.com. That is a full case break. The pick your teams, half case breaks. I think the pick your team, half case breaks, all cards ship, and the full case random teams, all cards ship. So, all right. So big thanks to this group for making it happen. Appreciate it. And there is the case of Topps Chrome Cosmic. See what we got. Good luck, everybody. I think the second half is in a filler, a team random filler. So go and check that out. So the Youth Invasion die cut, Chad is saying, is a case hit. The Scope Parallel is a box hit. And there's only 100 copies of Supernova, so that insert is, uh, is pretty big. All right, thanks. So we'll look out for those. So thanks for joining us on new release day. We've got plenty in the store. Pick your teams and random teams. So we've got six boxes on the left side, six boxes on the right side. We'll roll the die to see which side we're gonna do. One, two, three for the left side, four, five, six for the right side. And it's five. One, two, three, four, five, six. This side we'll save for pick your team two. <clears throat> All right, so you can see that I've marked those two. So we know they're from the same case. We should be able to run this back tonight if you want to. We got time to do it. I would love to do it. So there it is. There's the box right there. I like that sort of 80s -y sort of look right there. 20 packs per box, four cards per pack. Now Jason was saying that um, it seems like uh, it seems like. The autographs are every few boxes. Sam Banks, do all cards ship? Yes, they do. Per the item description, we always state one way or the other. Or if we don't, then that means all cards ship. Right, four autos per case, Chad Sick. The autos are few and far between, so it looks like it's a lot of uh, a lot of parallel hunting, I would imagine. These packs are kind of tough. Here's your first box. Good luck, everybody. We'll go kind of slow on this first box just because 
This is our first look at this. There's the back right here. This is uh, it's pretty cool. Yeah, Chad was saying it's sort of like a space version of Finest. I can see that. The rocket arms insert. So is this the what? This is the one per box. What do they call it? What do they call it uh, in Top's world? I think there's the base refractor, one in every 10 packs. Nucleus, one in every 15. There's blue moon to 99, gold interstellar to 50, orange galactic, black eclipse to 10, red flare, and a, and a super fractor, one of one. This must be the nucleus. One per box ish. One out of every 15 packs. And there's 20 packs per box, so you can do the math. Launched into orbit, die cut, and an autograph. On card, too. Andrew McCutcheon. Brewers, that's going to be for John. I like it. These cards really pop. And there's Fernando Tatis Jr., 11 out of 25. Orange Galactic. That's for the Padres, that'll be for Adam. Nice low number. Does Galactic mean that it has that sort of lava-y pattern in the background? Tatis Jr. die cut, launch into orbit die cut. And we got a Juan Yepes, 16 out of 99. The 99 is Blue Moon. Blue Moon, you saw me stand. That's for the Cardinals, that's gonna go to Shane. And there's another one of those nucleuses. Nice, thank you, Sam. All right, box two. All right, I like it. Now, is this a, I'm not sure if anyone knows, if the, is, this, it's, is this the debut release? Or is this like a product from like the early 2000s that they revived or something like that? According to uh, Cardboard debut, right, Chad saying? According to Cardboard Connection, yeah, this is a, although this is a new Chrome iteration, the set's overall style evokes a little Bowman's Best, a little Top's Finest, a little Top's Fire, if you remember, remember, if you remember Fire. I can see all that. Feel, see a little, uh, I feel a little inception in here as well. Some inception feels here.
All right, next box. Good luck. I'll go a little more quickly here. Um, Cy Young Awards announced today. Justin Verlander for the AL, Sandy Alcantara for the NL. And I think both of them got all the first place votes. Now, what about um, the MVP? Who, who, do you th who do you have in the MVP war? I think that's announced tomorrow. In the AL, Jordan Alvarez, Aaron Judge, and Choi Otani are the finalists. In the NL, Goldschmidt, Arenado, and Machado. Manny Machado are the finalists. Think there'll be any surprise? I feel like all the, most of the awards have been been fairly chalk. Look at this. A launched in, are these all silver? Launched into orbit die cut, Julio Rodriguez. That's for Chad Daw and his Mariners. Nice. Sam saying uh, Goldie. More Blue Moon, Jaron Duran, 69 out of 99. No, not, uh, not Jaron Duran, Johan Duran. Jared Duran's in uh, Boston. That one goes to Minnesota. That'll be for Chad. Chad Cromwell. Uh, two Chads in this break. Oh, they're all silver, but they're every one in 10 pounds. All right. Not bad. And we got some gold interstellar, maybe? I have these parallels up here. Gold Interstellar Refractor. These are to 50. 14 out of 50 for KC. That'll be for Raymond. Patrick Coxings Machado as the NL MVP. For AL, everyone's just assuming Aaron Judge, right? The guy on the box. That, that would be my guess. Although, I mean, you can argue that Otani should win it, but I think uh, I think Aaron Judge is, you know, a 60 homer season. I think definitely will be rewarded with the uh, MVP. Well, in fact, Aaron Judge probably carried that team. For a number of maybe months, there was a time when there's no no one was really hitting except for Aaron Judge. In the NL, I I think it's got to be. I think it's probably going to be Goldschmidt as well. Next box. Good luck. And Jose Barrios. It's to 10. That is a Black Eclipse Refractor to 10. Blue Jays. That's going to be Adam in Toronto. Speaking of the Blue Jays, uh, the Mariners, Chad's Mariners, and the Blue Jays did a, did a deal today.
Yeah, the Blue Jays sent Teoscar Hernandez to the Mariners in exchange for Eric Swanson and Adam Mako. How do you feel about that deal, Chad? Chad's our, our resident Mariners fan. There's Reese Hoskins for the Phillies. Jordan with the Phillies. That's Kyle Lewis to 99, Blue Moon, Refractor. I like the deal, yeah. I mean, I think uh, Swanson definitely has some good stuff, but I feel like you could you could try to find another Eric Swanson, right? Gold Interstellar, 30 out of 50, Ronald Acuna Jr. for the Braves, Patrick. But Teoscar Hernandez, look, look at the numbers. Uh, oh, and there's Julio Rodriguez, speaking of the Mariners. Uh, according to MLBTradeRumors.com, Hernandez, who turned 30, just 30 a month ago, will give the Mariners a heart of the order slugger, who's posted a stout 283, 333, 519 slash line, and 73 home runs and 71 doubles through 1,300 plate appearances over the past three seasons. And a stat cast darling. 94th percentile or better in hard hit rate, average exit velo, max exit velo, barrel rate, expected slugging percentage. This might, guy might be gone. So, I mean, that's a... Put that in the middle of that lineup, that relatively young lineup. And here's a Wander Franco launched into orbit die cut. That's pretty sweet. Who's got the Rays? Walter picked up the Rays. Nice. Or plastic dust out of there. We go. It's a cleaner one. Nice. All right. Halfway through this half case break. Next three. Now, what what else are the um, what else are the Mariners going to do in the off season? What what uh, what other things do they need to address? Ooh, Patrick thinking Papa Jer Justin Verlander. On there. They've got some pretty good starting pitching, but if they pop a Durl Justin Verlander on the top of that that rotation, plus get one of the one of the uh, elite shortstops out there on the market. Which shortstop do you prefer? Carlos Correa, Trey Turner, Xander Bogarts. No, Mariners aren't going to go for Justin Verlander. You want Correa. Swanson's the best of the class. I like Dansby Swanson a lot. I think he's he's pretty underrated. I think whoever loses out on the other shortstops and ends up with Dansby Swanson, I think that team's going to be very happy. 
Blue Moon Dalton Varsho to 99 for Greg and the Diamondbacks. Really great in the field as well. There's a Mike Trout launched into orbit. And here's Paul Goldschmidt, 87 out of 99. Yeah, your presumptive NL MVP. Cardinals, that'll be for Shane. And there is new new Mariner to Oscar Hernandez. Good move. Ooh, and an orange Freddie Freeman. 17 out of 25. The official name for that, Orange Orange Galactic. For Chad Cromwell and the Dodgers. Chad Dog getting all of those Julio Rodriguez. Z -z 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 among others. All right, two boxes to go. We got Kings at Oilers. TNT is what, what I'm looking at. King's up early, one nothing. Nice. No, no torque base. Not yet. And Shane Beaver to 50. Gold Interstellar. Great movie, Interstellar. Bobby Wood Jr. I think that's the first one I've seen of him. Just a base, but that'll go to uh, Raymond and the Royals. Oh, and there's a Torkelson right there. So a torque for Chad Daw. Maybe we'll find some parallels of him. And another Wander Franco for uh, Walter and the Rays.
Blue Moon, Eric Hosmer, 1999. That's Prince. And final box coming up. Good luck. I think Picker Team 2 is in a uh, team random style filler. So check it out, jazbeescasebreaks.com. Almost there. There you go. Final pack of the sixth and final box of this half case break. Tops Chrome Cosmic. Cosmic. And a Youth Invasion rookie die cut. I think Chad was saying earlier this is one of the, uh, this is a case hit, one per case, thereabouts. That's for Richard and the Angels. I was a little surprised that the Angels kind of gave up on Brandon Marsh as, as quickly as they did, but, but they did. Launch into Orbit Wander Franco and a Zach Granke, gold, interstellar, and a torque. So Chad Dog with the Torgelson. Zach Granke for the Royals going to Raymond. 14 out of 50. No worries, Rick. There he is. And the Wander Franco launched into orbit die cut. It's another one for Walter. I think there were a couple, right? All right, next stack, Blue Moon, Cedric Mullins. Three out of 99 for Chad Cromwell and the Orioles. There's a Bobby Wood Jr. for Raymond. Cedric Mullins, Blue Moon. And an autograph, Brian De La Cruz. I think that might be out of 10. It is. Nice. Who's got the fish? Chad Cromwell with the Marlins rookie auto. Seven out of ten. Cosmic Chrome autograph. Is it Topps Chrome Cosmic or is it Cosmic Chrome? Don't know. And there you go. There you have it, ladies and gentlemen. That was a nice little six box break of the brand new Topps Cosmic Chrome Baseball six box half case picker team number one. A lot of nice parallels, on card autographs. I have a feeling with the on card autos being few and far between, if you end up with the, uh, if you end up with the right player, right, that's, that'll probably go for, for a lot just because the autographs are, are pretty rare. There you go, gang. I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. I'll see you next time for the next Cosmic Break. Bye-bye.